residents in the city of New Orleans. You've heard the story any number of times. You know, a road project, a street project will begin. They'll cut a hole in the street, and then it'll just sit there. Either it'll get repaired and never filled. We've seen them with, with weeds growing in them. Well, the, the city of New Orleans is now kind of pivoting. They're changing how they're attacking uh, these kinds of projects across the city. So what's happening? It's a pretty big shift, if you will, in the way they attack the infrastructure projects. The city's getting ready to infuse about three hundred million bond dollars into the effort that would go along with a whole vat of fema slash federal dollars to clear the way for a number of things to happen street projects that have been sitting gaping would be completed in short order fema money would basically pay for the street repair on top and the bond money would actually pay for the subsurface repairs the water the drainage the sewer issues down below one of the ones in question, the one we're looking at right now on Harmony Street, so old that when we looked at it yesterday, weeds were growing in it. What we're standing right now is you're seeing every one of these holes is going to be covered. All the drainage line, all the water line, and all the sewer lines beneath it that are broken are going to be fixed. And by the end of November, this neighborhood will have no more holes. Now, how they're going to go about doing that is kind of interesting. We're going to talk about that in a few more minutes. Also, at the same time, there's going to be a contractor report card online coming up in about 30 days. You can see how the contractor on your project is doing or not doing, if you will. Guys, 